The 25 people killed during bombardments this weekend were killed during two different airstrikes. The first one on Saturday targeted what Khartoum residents now call a Dagalo market in reference to uh, Mohamed Amdan Dagalo, the head of the Rapid Support Forces. It's a market where people uh, sell stolen goods and uh, black market goods. According to local residents, at least 20 people were killed. And then this Sunday, another airstrike targeted a civilian house, killing five people who were buried under the rubble. So uh, why is uh, the Sudanese military is still targeting civilians. Well, uh, to understand that, you have to understand the situation on the ground in Khartoum. The rapid support forces are still controlling several areas uh, of the capital, so the army relies on its air supremacy to bomb these civilian neighborhoods where the rapid support forces are hiding. That's for the situation in the capital. But let's also mention uh, the capital of uh, South Darfur, the city of uh, Niala, where the rapid support forces and the uh, military have been clashing for a few days. And for the first time since the beginning of the war, uh, the army uh, this Sunday decided to bomb uh, the city. It's still impossible to know if people were killed or injured during these attacks because there is no more network in the city of uh, Niala. Most of the telecommunication infrastructures have been destroyed by uh, the clashes, but the risk is very uh, high since the beginning of the fighting. Thousands of people have been killed and many more have been injured.